hey welcome back uh, in this lecture we are gonna work or the login logout buttons be because uh, we need to actually destroy the sec uh, session that we have created during the registration of the customer so we need to actually destroy that session as well so we can go ahead and work or the login page as well so here uh, inside the I mean inside the, all of the pages index page card page checkout page and all the pages but the most important is this index page where we will do some real work first of all in the in index.php page we will start the session and uh, then you scroll down and in here after the go to cart page we'll add another uh, link which will be something like uh, PHP and we'll say if is is not set dollar underscore session customer underscore email if it's not said that then we will simply echo if is not set in that case we will echo ahrab is equal to checkout dot php and we will say login this is a link in else situation that's mean the person is logged in so in that case we will simply echo and we'll show here the logout button so the person can log out we'll say log out dot php and we will write the text as logout that's it and we need to actually create the logout page as well control n control n i have pressed and new pages in front of you start php and close php block and after that first of all session start set session start function and then session underscore destroy that is another function and echo script script close and redirect the person to window dot open and redirect the person to index dot php with a self attribute so I will save it using control n inside the main folder with logout dot php logout is the name and dot php is extension is extension Okay, save now when we have started the session while the customer was, re was registering uh, the account or was creating the account so we registered a session or here you can see and that is the email so we need to actually destroy finish that session at a point when the user wants similarly like you uh, log into Facebook and when you do your work and you check out your status and your profile etc and when you click logout so you then cannot access your Facebook profile without entering the your email and password so that is the same thing there is uh, a point where we can uh, actually destroy the session or finish the session so the person needs to log in again so we have created this logout page that will be a link uh, everywhere we have created this ins uh, inside the index.php but we will copy and paste that, uh, this to all the pages so when someone will click that uh, link I mean logout so the person will come here and we have destroyed the session at this point and have redirected the person back to the home page I mean index page so that's it now we will come over here you can see it is written logout that's mean the person the the session is activated therefore 
this is written logout we click this then this will be login instead of logout we can just uh, change the color of this like uh, can use style and color white white or we can use orange very simple control is to save and the same style for this login as well color orange control is to save refresh the page and you will see that is now logout is or uh, having uh, orange color now when someone cl will click this button so automatically uh, he will be re redirected again to this page and the session will be finished I mean destroyed just I will click it and you can see the same page is there and now the link is, has been changed to login so when that person clicks the login so he will be taken back to checkout.php and there is the login form very simple so now once again we have created this thing now we need to actually work on this login form in next video so we can create the PHP script because we started this whole thing for this now we will uh, after completing this we will then do some small things as well like uh, you know like changing this guest to the person email if uh, the session is active or that person is logged in so we can change this to welcome that person email and also we will add uh, the login logout link here after the go to cart etc so in next video i am coming and we will work on this login form i mean the php script